Let's see how we can install the latest version of PyCharm on our Windows 11 system and how we can create a Python project. First, go to this URL. I'll have this link in the description below. Now, there are two versions of PyCharm. One is the professional version. This is paid one. So as you can see, it's saying free 30 day trial. So this is paid. After 30 days, you'll have to pay. And there is a community version that is free. So we will download this free one. Click on download. And my PyCharm is downloading. Now click on open file and your installer will open. If you are asked, do you want to allow this app to make changes? Click on yes. And finally, we have our installer open. Click on next. And this is where your PyCharm will be installed. Now you can choose to install it in other location by clicking on browse and choosing your other directory. But I'll leave it in the default directory for now. Click next. Now no need to do anything here. Just click next. Click install and your installation will start. So finally our installation is complete now you can click on run pycharm community edition and hit finish and your pycharm will open and we will see how we can create our first project just click on ok here if, if you are asked this and our pycharm is open now let's create our first project so click on new project and let's call it Python project itself and this is where it will be stored and now leave all these things selected now here you will have to choose a python version so I already have Python 2 version of Python installed, so I can choose any one of these. But if you don't have Python installed, just click on any one of these options that you want to install. Or check the link in the description, it will show you how to install Python. Now I will choose the 3.9 version and click create. Let me maximize this. And now our Python project is ready. So it will do some things here. Let it finish. If you notice here, there is a .venv folder inside our Python project. So this is the virtual environment. Now what is a virtual environment? In virtual environment, we can install specific libraries that are just used for this project and this virtual environment will not be used for other projects. We will not use it for other projects. It can be used, but we will not. So let's say we want to use Pandas version 1. Point something for this project and Pandas version 2. Point something for other, another project. So virtual environments help us do that. Now. Let's create a new file, right click, click on new and click on python file. Let's call it main.py and our python file is created as you can see here. Now let's just put a simple hello world. Now you can click on this button here or click shift F10 to run this. So I'll click this and as you can see our code is printed. This is how you can install PyCharm and create projects and run your projects. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.